yeah, you right. Mm-hmm. Nigga think he got it like that when I act like that, all right. Mm-hmm. My brother had to backtrack, backtrack. Tag on fact, you right. Mm-hmm. Yeah. What up, what up, what up? We are back. It is Tad Radio at Dash Radio. Make some noise. We are here. It's Tad Radio, the first influencer only radio show in the world. World, world. world. <laughs> uh, coming to you from beautiful Hollywood, California. My name is Kevin Ryder. I'm your host and my beautiful co host, Miss Haley Delane. What's up, girl? What's up, guys? How are you? Good, good. We chilling. We chilling. And our amazing guest are in the house uh wes has asked because he's such a gentleman that we lead with the lady so <laughs> chanel what's cracking how are you i'm well how are you guys we're good, good. we're popping out here thanks for being here and then of course our very special guest mr west good what up what up what up how what's up people you? i'm good thank you guys oh, so so the sound effects and everything that's my favorite <laughs> uh, thanks, and then and then last but not least, I do not want to leave out our boy Splack for making it. We have a special guest in special the building. Guest. Yo, what up? What up? Hey. What's up, my brother? Splack in the building. <laughs> it's good to see everybody. Thank you all for making it. Um, as I said, trending all day. Tad Radio, the first influencer only radio show in the world, elevating the space, talking about what's going on in the influencer world. Um, because you guys are putting in work, hey. putting in work. You're getting That's fans, right. and it's really going down. So. We're going to pop off real quick talking about intros and talking about who you are and what you're doing. So, Janelle Marie, you're in the building. Can you tell us where you're from, what you're doing, how you ended up here? Yeah, well, my name's Janelle Marie, of course. I'm from Miami, Florida. I've been living in L.A. for a couple years now. I went to school here, studied journalism, but um, really I'm still focusing on acting and journalism. I kind of live a double life. I'm on the Disney Channel. Hey. Oh, uh, no, yeah, no. and then Fresh. I just came back from Chile. I'm also a host for Monster Jam. So she's kind of Chile. all over. Yeah, yeah, she's Chile. Chile. No, no. Chile. Chile. No. Latino and proud. I like that. Um, so, yeah, just kind of doing a lot of things, broadening the spectrum. I feel like I live a double life because I'm a storyteller, mm. but then I tell people stories as well. So, it's kind of interesting to be uh, on both sides. So, what do you tell us about what you're doing? You said you're on Disney. Where are you at on Disney? So I'm a movie surfer, a movie surfer, sorry. (laughs) Um, And basically um, we kind of do sketches with all the actors or like upcoming Marvel films, et cetera, um, Pixar. And so like I was able to go on the set of Black Panther. I'll be doing some other stuff that I can't say. Um, Now next week I'm going to Atlanta um, and check out some other sets. But it's really fun. I've been with them for two years now and got to visit and work with Steven Spielberg and among other um, actors that's, Chris Pratt. Well, no big that's deal. Hard. Nobody no knows who Steve yeah. Spielberg yeah. is. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that was like honestly that's one of my proudest moments. Like to interview him and then yeah. talk about the oh, BFG wow. and stuff. So it's weird because I was like, oh, it's so kitty, but mm. it's also fun at the same time because you get to get that interaction. That's right. Awesome. You said it's kitty uh, from looking across the table. You look about sixteen. <laughs> <laughs> Forever young. I got that Benjamin button. Hey, hey. okay. Hey. Hey. Got the good jeans. I won't have to worry about that. I will this say too, Miami. like there's something about the influencer crew, like that they all look super young. Like. I'm just like, what's the secret pill everyone's taking? Because I need it. <laughs> I think it's sure. keeping that inner child alive. I like yeah. that. I like right. that. That's a good one. That's a good one. Keeping it popping. All right. That sounds <laughs> great. Well, thank you, Janelle, for making it all the way here today <laughs> with your busy schedule, Wes. Very busy. Yeah. How do you follow up after that? <laughs> Are you kidding your me? Your life is dope. <laughs> <laughs> She's got it popping. But you got it popping too, brother. Wes Armstrong, Wes Good, for those that don't yeah. know. Man, put us up on game, dude. Um, okay. I uh, grew up in Japan, moved there in third grade, stayed to my senior high school, moved to the States. Um, just trying to figure it out. I ended up going, uh, graduated in North Carolina, going to Texas and Florida, nice. fell into filmmaking, uh, started out with photography. Then that grew into like taking pictures of all kinds of celebrities into, uh, music videos, doing them for them. And then moving out to LA about seven years ago and getting into the influencer game like four years ago. Nice. And that changed my life. There, yeah, there's <laughs> yeah, a, just a yeah. little bit. There's a lot there because Japan. Yeah. So let's, how is growing up from third grade through high school in Japan? Uh, it was dope, man. I just grew up with like a melting pot of just a bunch of different cultures. Do you speak you know? Japanese? Uh, enough to get through a train station. Hey, that's pretty okay. much a general yeah. statement. Okay. Yeah. Like, I'm sure you got some. I, I, I was more ways. of a, I was more of a class clown yeah. and chasing girls. You know, there you um, go. so but like you know the culture out there was just you know every race you could think of pretty much mixed up there. Everyone was military kids coming from all over the world. So. Yeah. Uh, you know, I can go to pretty much any state and find a friend there that I went to elementary school yeah. with. That's so, cool. Yeah. Okay. 
International. 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 <laughs> So, so yeah. So you went from Japan to you said Atlanta, North Carolina. Excuse me, North Carolina. Yeah. Whereabouts in North Carolina? Uh, Jacksonville, another military base. Okay, nice. And uh, it's crazy. I got there, and there was like kids from my middle school there, um, in my senior year of school. So, um, like I said, you know, just growing up, you run into different people you meet all over the world. Right. Um, and that happened in college, and it happens out here today. Like I run into people from ninth grade. I'm like, dang man, that's crazy. We was in yeah. Japan, fool. Wow. Man. So um. So yeah, so uh, and then North Carolina to Atlanta. Nope. Why do I keep saying Atlanta? I don't, I don't know. Texas. I, because I I've said Atlanta. Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> I like planted that in you. You want me to live in Atlanta? <laughs> <laughs> I don't care. Um, but yeah, I went to I went to Texas. Got into radio. I did radio. That's how I got the name. What's good? Oh. And then oh. um, from there, I started doing music videos and commercials and short films and uh, yeah. Then I got into Vine. Nice. Vine came around and uh. I started shooting with my friends all the time, shooting their videos, and uh, yeah, fresh. Yeah, and so that's that's actually interesting because did you guys see? Actually, Taylor, one of our producers, put me up on game yesterday. She said that Vine Two is coming out. Did oh. you see this? Yeah, yeah. I recently it. heard about this. What is too. The, the, what's the deal? <laughs> <laughs> we're all is it real? We're all waiting. I, I, I'm, I don't know. I have I have a couple different theories on it, but um, you know, if it comes back, cool. Mm -hmm. You know, if not. Will you come out of retirement? I mean, I never, I never retired. You know, like, do <laughs> I want to do I, do I want to make six second videos again? Not, Not really. really. <laughs> but you know, because that was like some of the most stressful times. I would say for a lot of us. I mean, like making a story in six seconds. Really. And then like being in a group of all of our friends who are highly creative, like trying to find that time to be able to shoot it, and you shoot everyone else's. Then by the time it gets to yours, it's like. Everyone's editing theirs because you have to post every day. Right, right. So, you know what I mean? Like, you're like you're getting high energy, then you're getting, like, as the day goes on, the energy's getting lower yeah, and lower. Yeah. And for six seconds, it would take us four to six hours sometimes, like, wow. editing, handbrake. Remember handbrakes, Black? <laughs> like, it was... What's a hand, What's a handbrake? Let it's like, know. It's like, first, we had to, like, film it in the camera and edit, you know, like, it's like shooting for the edit. You messed up, you got to start all the way over. And then we were able to break in behind the camera and use this program to like edit within the camera roll and mm -hmm. be all on the phone. It was a nightmare. Wow. It was like, it was fun, but it was also like a stressful nightmare. Yeah. And, um, but it was, you know, it built us to where we're at today for sure. For sure. And now you have this amazing series on Facebook that yeah. is just blowing up and trending all day. Got the exclusive behind the scenes, so go oh, check yeah. it out. Oh, yeah. Um, <laughs> but yeah, talk to us about that journey as well. Um, Yeah, that was a show I... I did a long time ago on like Instagram with Splack and um, our boy Woody. And uh, yeah, it just, it took off every time we posted it. And then, uh, you know, Facebook, they started their new thing called Shows and they asked me what I wanted to do. And I was like, ah, let me try this out, you know, since I seen it was something that was successful before. And um, yeah, it's doing good. They're happy with it. I'm happy with it. And, and you're a Facebook creator. They just like yeah. highlighted you. Right. There's lots of, <laughs> there's lots of yeah. shit going down. <laughs> yeah, Facebook, they, um, they, they launched a new program called Facebook Creators where they picked creators they liked working with. And um, I was lucky to be chosen. And did, they did a little feature on me and just talked about, uh, you know, what I think about filmmaking. Because at the end of the day, you know, all influencers are, I think, directors and filmmakers. And we're starting, mm -hmm. you know, like we're, we're changing the way media is consumed. Uh, so I, you know, I, I'm taking that part very seriously, you know. So, um, you know, they, they, I don't know, they gravitated towards that. You know, like I do a lot of content that's more, I guess, cinematically complimenting. You know, I don't, I wouldn't know how to explain it really. But uh, yeah, they wanted to show the transition from influencer to wanting to be a, a big time movie studio director. Oh, I just graduated the Sony Directors Program, so. Hey. Oh, wow, oh, that's huge. Right. Yeah, yeah. Nice. yeah. yeah. <laughs> that's what I'm talking about. So like, you know, that's on the way to like, you know, the goal at the end of the day is to direct television and direct uh, features, so. Fire. Nice. Yeah. That's great, real, that's great yeah. man. So you yeah. actor, director, producer, grip, PA. Like, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. All the skills. yeah, man. That's good. That's well, awesome. Good on you, man. And it's, you know what's funny about all of it is that I think that uh, the effort and the expertise that it require that's required to be able to be successful on these platforms is diminished, and the public has no idea. 
No. Yeah. How much work, how much expertise, how much focus it takes to be able to even do a six second, much less oh, a yeah. 30 minute yeah. Right, piece of content. Yeah. yeah. I mean, even our team, when we went over to Wes's house before couples night, their team, their a production team rolled up and it was like three people. And they're like, yeah, we're shooting seven episodes in a day. And my team's like, what are they doing? Like, <laughs> like they were so amazed. Um, yeah. So yeah, I mean, that's so true that so many people don't realize, you know, what you guys do in the way that you guys do it. Yeah. Definitely. And, and, and that's how you get, um, you know, I know Wes got like 75 million billion <laughs> followers across all platforms and audiences. So even when he shouts out trending all day, I'm like, what well, these 59 people who just follow me? <laughs> oh, that's man. Great. But shout out to both of you guys for the hard work. Haley. Yeah. What we got going on, girl? We're about to play Never Have I Ever, guys. Are you ready? Oh. <laughs> uh, Wes is going so. into the game knowing he's losing. So <laughs> this should be good. This should be good. It's happening. That, that was a great sound effect. Um, Janelle, start us off. All right, let's get this started. Um, never have I ever been walked in on. Walked in on doing what? You know, the dirty. Like the, you know, it could be anything. Do we, do we have to take a drink? <laughs> Of your water. <laughs> of your <laughs> water. <laughs> we got to spike the water, Wes. All right, so we're playing with five fingers just to five uh, fingers. recap. Five fingers, so five right. fingers. Okay. So never have I ever been walked in on. Okay, so. I okay. You guys have issues. So <laughs> Wes, tell us about your uh, experience. Um. <laughs> <laughs> How old were you? Uh. Oh, it was like yesterday. <laughs> uh, okay. It was like um, dang, I didn't think we were going here. Yep. <laughs> uh. I took it there real fast. <laughs> you took it there real fast. I'm trying to think of it. Like, I want to give the PG version of this story. No, mm, no. Give it to us real. It's internet. Okay. Uh, <laughs> let's just say uh, daughter walked in and oh. then, them, uh, then oh. the mom walked in oh. and pulled the daughter out the no. room. <laughs> no, that's like worst case. That is so and I'm just like, <laughs> And I'm just like, they're like, uh. I oh can't. no! It was it was it's, it was like a scene out of a cartoon. It was like mommy, <laughs> and then the, the, oh, the, the, mom, no. the mom comes in. The mom's Spanish, so she says something in Spanish. Guadalupe, <laughs> <laughs> that's great. Yeah. That's great. And so, you too. So uh, I got one question oh, for yeah. us. Yeah. The, the big question is: Did you stop, or was you like, "I'm just <laughs> this is natural, and I'm going to continue." <laughs> <laughs> you guys can't see Wes's face, but he definitely continued. <laughs> that's great. Uh, uh, that's good. How about, how about you? Oh, so you're going to put it on me? Yeah, of course. Um, well, yeah, I mean, you know, one night, late night, I had a window. <laughs> uh, I was about 15 at a window in my room that was on the first floor. You know, I would invite friends in. Uh, one night my mom happened to wake up in the middle of the night to get some water and heard a little squeaky squeaky and that's the end of the story great wow, that's great <laughs> I had to shut it down it wasn't I couldn't continue like Wes <laughs> she was right back out the window <laughs> that's oh, great God. that's hilarious alright Wes you're up next oh um, oh wait, oh, wait, 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 wait oh, she's gonna yeah, she tried to skip she's, her question yeah she was like wait. um Sneaky. I was very young. I was like in like junior high and it was like nothing like exciting. And his mom walked in and it was like really awkward and mm. really embarrassing. And then it was over. Okay. Yeah. All right. So, you did know. Did you stop or did you keep going? Definitely stop. Definitely okay. stop. Okay. Yeah. I was like extremely young and mortified. Okay. Uh, <laughs> um, okay. So we all three, well, two of us have to drink and Wes has to do, you know, like, is to drink the water. Drink your water. Oh, oh gosh. He's going to have to use the bathroom so bad. <laughs> <laughs> Dang. Uh, I'm can we, uh, do we have to, do I have to ask questions? Because I don't have one yet. Do I have one? I have a question for the questions. It should be definitely, I mean, I know I, it's the clear rule. It's something you've never done either. Like the person asking the question has never done it. Yeah. Right. But right? sometimes okay, cool. it happens and you'll roll one off and you've done it and okay. then you get stuck. Then you get stuck. All right. Come back to me because I'm still thinking. All right, Kevin. All right. It's on you. Um, okay, never have I ever uh, tried to go to the bathroom and didn't make it. That never <laughs> happened to me. Oh, Janelle. Wow. Oh. Whoa. Where? <laughs> no, it was already like pulling up to my house. I just couldn't hold it anymore. I was like, ah! And I was like, my, my mom and I said in Spanish, like, me, me. <laughs> like, I was just like pissed myself. I couldn't, I couldn't hold it. That, in your car? I was like getting off the car already. I was like, I had already like strategized it. Just like one light just took way too long. I'm like, I'm not going to make it. And then uh, it happened. Wow. 
Wow. wow. But Dang. you didn't mess up the upholstery. I did not. Thank God. My, my car survived. How long survived. did you sit in it, though? I didn't sit in it. I made it out oh, the car. I, had, I made it, like, pulled in the driveway. So I just, like, went straight to my apartment. It was, like, the perfect opportunity to... Cause you so you, left, so you left, a, yeah, left a trail at least, though, from the car <laughs> to the bathroom, right? That's true. A <laughs> little that, bunny that trail of peace. <laughs> and then, and you know what? I didn't look back. You didn't look back. I just... Man. Did you go straight to the shower or did you swing by the fridge real quick? No, I go straight to the shower. <laughs> That's pretty good. All right, okay. All right, Wes, well, you ready? Uh, oh, yeah, Janelle, you got a drink over there. Don't don't forget true. that part. Sip up. <laughs> and the... It was never have I ever used a bathroom on myself, right? Basically. Okay. Um, <laughs> I feel like everything I'm gonna think of, I've told, I'm telling on myself though. That's the thing. I mean, well, I mean, sometimes it happens. No, I'm just not good at this game then. <laughs> <laughs> um, oh, well, no. <laughs> uh, You've done it all. I Yeah. You like I've, I really have. <laughs> um, never have I ever... Man, I suck at this game. <laughs> uh, never ever have I ever puked in someone's car. Car? Nope, uh, haven't done that. I, I think I'm good. I think I'm good. Ooh, oh, another no. one bites the dust, Janelle. What Cough happened? it up. Cough up the story. Well, I never, <laughs> like, it was only, I think, the only time that's ever happened to me, but I was 20, mm. underage drinking. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I think it was, uh, what is that? It still exists. It's in Hollywood. Um, Next to, oh my God. Um, like a club? It's a club. In Hollywood. In Hollywood by, okay, you know where the uh, Amoeba music is? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Right there. There's a club right there? Oh, is that Playhouse? Like Avalon or? Oh, Playhouse. No, not no. Playhouse. Mm -hmm. Who is the, the other one that used to be popping? Oh, oh. Not Supper either. It's, it's gonna come to me. Area. Yeah. Okay. It's gonna come to me. LA Club. But um, I. I remember it was at the end of the night, but I thought I was 20. So it's like, right, you know, right before 21st. And I had like champagne drunkness. Oh, mm -hmm. that's rough. Mm -hmm. Yep. And then my friend's mom had picked this up. And like, I had also like, a, it was like that almost like, I knew it was coming. And then like, I just got like the edge and I it just, it happened. <laughs> wow. It that's... just, but I, you know, that's just when you're young and you shouldn't be drinking. Uh, and, uh, you gotta pay uh, for it. Yeah, well, exactly. now that you said that you shouldn't be drinking, you gotta take a drink. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's the actual. Exactly. All right, it's my turn. Um, never have I ever had a sexual experience with a friend's parent. Whoa. Mm. Hey. Turn up. You know, yeah. sometimes you got to go there. Turn up. Wes, Me. did you drop one? Oh, no, no, no. Oh, I'm chilling. <laughs> I'm chilling. Right. Did you? No? No, I think, no? I think everyone's all, good. I think I'm everybody chilling. here. All right. Yeah, nice. Know. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you never know. Yeah, I was okay. say, you never know. You never when you know. least expect That's it. That's true. That's. Too true. Um, <laughs> all, right, all right, it's Janelle. Um, never have I ever, ever had a Tinder account. Oh, gosh. Oh, yeah, I'm, you don't wow. have, wow, never? Mm -mm. I mean, I never really used it, but I did ha definitely have one. I've never been on a Tinder date, but, but I've been <laughs> active. You know, I've, I've been, but so yeah. hold on. So never? Really, never, guys? Uh -uh. Are you on like Raya or one of the other ones? I Bumble. was on Raya for like, a 2.5 seconds. Mm -hmm. And then it just wasn't for me. Did you go on a riot date? Nope. It's all, it was all like pen pals. I'm not looking for a pen pal here. I'm looking for like <laughs> to go on Some a love. date. Yeah. Like some local. <laughs> yeah. So I just figured stick it, you know, the old school way and just slide in someone's DMs. I like it. Oh, yeah. yeah. That's, 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 not, not that's the old school. Not even. That's not the old I school haven't way? even been on a date through a DM either. Really? Oh, wow. That's probably a good thing. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I right. will be sliding my DMs. Oh, okay. Hold on, uh, Wes, you ain't on Bumble, uh, Black Planet. Um, <laughs> Black uh, <laughs> Planet. No, I mean, you know, I I got someone. Uh, but, oh, nice. you know, how, how I did that was, you know. The good old, old fashioned good old, way. Good old fashioned yeah, way. It's not, no, not even a DM slide. You yeah. go to the very first photo. Oh, whoa. And then you say, congrats, you've been stopped. Oh. That was the move? That was the move, man. You got to be different. Shout out. That, well, now, hey. everybody, now everybody's Gentlemen, going, no, now all my followers are going to be like, Wes put us up on game. And then when you go to some pretty girl's first picture, it's going to be it's like be 18 like, people. Oh, all the way down. I'm like, who the hell like this? Speaking of, though, for those of you who don't know, Brandy is Wes's amazing girlfriend. Um, how long have you guys? The eyes got big. The eyes did get big. <laughs> He's excited. Uh, we'll just cut it out if this is uh, inappropriate. <laughs> uh, you good. You good. Um, yeah, we've been together for about... Two years. It was amazing. Oh, wow. Yeah. 
yeah, you guys are um, amazing people together. So Thank shout you. out. Thank shout you. out. All right, K Ryder. It's on me. Okay. Um, never have I have one for you guys. Never have I ever had a near death experience. Hmm. Uh, near death. Whoa. I finally got him. Yeah. You did. Wes is the finger went down. The only one. I'm the only one. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I don't know. I feel like there's been a couple of them. Uh, one was I was uh, driving on a like one way road. I was like two way, one way each way. And um, I was going to, to school and I forgot something. So I was going to make a left turn on the road to make a U-turn. And a big ass truck, wham, hits the side of my car as I like, I'm making the left turn and tears off the whole front end. If it would have been a few feet back, it would have hit me. Whoa. And the truck hit the curb and then popped up. Like I never, it was like some, some monster truck stuff have popped up into the air and then landed in a ditch. And the person got, got out was a cop. <gasps> yeah. Really? They were like flying down the road, I guess, to get to work or something like that. Whoa. Ridiculous. Yeah. It was crazy. That's crazy. I didn't even know how to react, you know, like, because I was, like, more scared than worried about if I was hurt. So I'm out the car like, oh, my God. <laughs> you know, like, what the hell happened? Wow. <laughs> you know? That's crazy. So, yeah. That's Damn. crazy, man. Well, it's good that you, so you got out with no scratches? Yeah, no, no scratches, no nothing. Um, wow. I was good. Um, but that junk was crazy. Wow. I mean, like, it was like, it was like. How long, like, what, how old were you? Uh, I was, like, 19. Wow. So, yeah, yeah you were, like, yeah. Yeah. Damn. That's, serious, that's crazy. Wow. Well, glad take, you're here. Take a here drink to tell of water, bro. Take oh, a yeah. drink of water. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Wes, you're up. Um, never have I ever uh, went skinny dipping in a stranger's pool. Yikes. I'm down. I gotta wow. Go. Yeah. Gotta Was it fun? Yeah, you know, <laughs> it's, 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 you know. So I grew up in the Midwest. I'm from Detroit. So, mm -hmm. like, you know, there's a lot of, like, pools and backyards and suburban areas. And so... You got to get inventive when you, you know, yeah. in the suburbs. And so I might have hopped a couple fences, had a good time with some friends. That's, that's exciting. Yeah, that's been also like a complete stranger. Like you like jumped somebody's like fence oh, went yeah, into yeah, their yeah. backyard. Oh, yeah. It was, yeah. It was trespassing. Oh, but I mean, wow. was, is this like summertime? Oh, man. I imagine Detroit just being cold all the time. Yeah. Eight months out of the year is freezing. It's froze. Um, but no, I, it, it had to be a cooler part of the year because it was a group of us. Yeah, we did. We did the group thing, not the group thing, but like uh, it was a group. But, I understand. Group but, but like, <laughs> why don't you just bring swimming trunks? Why would you jump in it butt naked with a whole bunch of friends? Well, see, Wes, you're it drinking was more exciting, water. Like I guess. That. And when you're not drinking water, sometimes you make sketchy decisions. <laughs> hey guys, let's all get naked and jump in this stranger's pool. How many, were there a lot of people? That's how it goes. It was a handful. Oh, wow. It was a handful. That's crazy. And the lights came on and the guy came oh, out. Oh, no yeah, way. That was a real thing. But, <laughs> you know, you grabbed you your trunks and yeah. you hopped the fence Dang. back. and you, you had trunks on, too, and just took the trunks off. I think I had clothes on. Okay, that would make more sense. Got this it. Was, this was high school. <laughs> so it was a very right. long, long, long time ago. You got to drink up. Yeah. You got to drink up. Drink That's up. funny. Who's up? It's me. Never have I ever made out with a stranger. <laughs> <laughs> Um, yeah. yeah, it's close. If it's a close on. call, come on. Wes. I'm trying to think. Take your time. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Ooh, yeah, I'm good. I don't know. I'm good. All right. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Nothing, yeah. you know? That's no. That's the. That's one thing I pride myself on. Really? Mm -hmm. Never. What about you? Oh, you got a finger down. Yeah. Tell my pride is. My pride <laughs> is low. <laughs> 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 Yeah, we don't gotta yeah. get to the story, we, okay. but it's on the road meeting people. It's yeah, yeah, we're it's just happen. yeah, nice get long. I think decision. too, just so you know, Wes is definitely keeping fingers up, but I think that uh, I, I'm on three. <laughs> <laughs> so we're tied. I think you might yeah. have a story there, but we'll let him slide. We'll oh, let yeah, him slide. Yeah, All right, so Janelle's got three fingers. I've got three fingers. How many fingers? I, He's got three I too. Have, apparently, I have ten. Well, right, but up three or up. Got it. Yeah. Well, Mr. Ryder, it looks like. Is it my turn so I can get y'all? I no no. Okay, this, that's it. So have a drink. No drink no, on I don't want left. I, I just drank. <laughs> oh, you want to go another round and see? We're not done yet. Okay, let's do it. <laughs> we're, we're finishing this. Like, he's he's determined. Who's let's turn go, is it? Janelle. Janelle. My turn. Um, <laughs> should we go naughty or nice? Naughty. No, always. No, always. Never have I ever purchased something at a sex store. Are you serious? Mm -hmm. What do you I order know. it online? Not even. I have nothing. Boring girl. <laughs> we gotta we gotta talk after this. <laughs> she said missionary only. <laughs> Reasons why I'm single. <laughs> I gotta get yeah. Uh, Wes, uh, we'll you, you got your hands down. I mean, 
Yeah, you know, you got to get you some candles. You got to hey. get you a little, hey. some, uh, some baby yeah. oils. You know what I mean? So, yeah. <laughs> baby oils. Yeah. He just named two things that you definitely don't <laughs> get. <laughs> <laughs> but that's okay. Yeah. They do. They got, got some, a brand they to some, they got some, Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, we've clearly been. So, I mean, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You've but that was a good one. You definitely got all of us. So, hey. way to knock us out. Solid. Mm -hmm. Mr. Ryder, it's on you. But we got to drink and Wes is asked to drink water. Yep, yep. Oh, yeah. Wes has got to drink water. Um, <laughs> I bought baby powder too. <laughs> Crazy, man. <laughs> what a sex right. story you went to. <laughs> I'm an animal. I'm dangerous. All right. I got, I got one for you. Never have I ever gone to church and got tipsy on the same day. That's so not true. You don't know nothing about me, girl. <laughs> uh, we got fingers oh, down over here. Janelle. We got her. I am. Um, it was, but it was the other way around. I went to church first and then, you know, I got turned. Does that count? Oh, yeah, it counts. Yeah, so it was like a baptism, and then my friends texted me like, hey, we're going on the boat. This is, I was in Miami. Mm -hmm. Like, we're going on the boat. You want to go? I'm like, hell yeah. So pick me up. I changed from my church dress in the boat little cabin thing. It was like an open fisherman boat into my bikini, and like, there you go. <laughs> Had Pretty a great amazing. afternoon. That's wow. great. That's great. Wes, not you? You been, you just? Nah. Nah, nah, nah. I be chilling. I be chilling. I be chilling. <laughs> I be chilling. I'm not sure. Yeah, that I just mean, means we'll, you don't. We'll get the truth that later. That just means you don't go to church. <laughs> That's all that means. <laughs> all right, Wes, it's on you. What's uh, your last okay. one? Uh, never have I ever uh, used the bathroom in a bottle and someone drank out of it. Oh. oh. That's that crazy. That is rough. That's crazy. That's crazy. I don't know why you're looking at people like. <laughs> yes. Nobody, yes. Does, does, like Nobody does that. <laughs> Nobody looked no. over at the homie and was like, "You got a story to tell." <laughs> yeah, the story. Yeah. Time. He he's still Who's looking like he's got a story. Tea bottles? <laughs> I, I'm, just, I'm no, I'm not. I'm not looking at him. I got a story. I mean, that's why I put my finger down because I can't think he's of anything. Whoa. What's the story? So my senior year of high school, we're playing pranks on everybody. I'm playing pranks on everybody. Mm -hmm. I don't know why. I just. Sometimes when I do things, I just kind of go overboard. I'm, I was the kid that played too much. Mm -hmm. And um, I wanted to get this kid that I didn't like back <laughs> <laughs> for something he did to me. And so every morning, this was on our senior trip, they put apple juice on our on our bus. And I was like, well, this apple juice today is going to be a bit warm. <laughs> <laughs> and he drank it. So I put it in his seat and... Like, for whatever reason, he didn't drink his apple juice that day. But we were getting back on the bus later on. So I'm like, all right, cool. We already know what seats is going to be. And my best friend ended up drinking the piss. <laughs> so I get on the bus and I'm like, I'm like, yo, what up? I'm saying what up to everybody. And they're like, yo, Wes, Wes, Wes. I'm like, what? They're like, Stephen drank the piss. I was like, oh, <laughs> shit. So I look on the side of the bus. He's gagging and throwing up. I was like, ah, oh, man, I felt so bad. No. no. So, yeah. So Are you guys still friends? Yeah, yeah, no, we're still friends. <laughs> But it was meant for someone else. <laughs> Shocking. Yeah. Did you ever tell him? Would you like it was my? Oh pitch no, club? he knew. Like everyone knew except the kid I was trying to get. Oh wow, that is so and, uh, funny. That's, that's pretty good. Yeah, that's good. That's, good. that's oh, a yeah. good story. That's rare. All right, I got yeah, our last true. one. Let's see who we right. if we can get anyone out on this one. Hook us up. All right, never have I used a household item as a sex toy. Oh. Hey, you got to try to get it interesting. <laughs> <laughs> oh, household. I don't know what guys are using. I, I, I mean, coming from the one that's never been to bought anything sex store, as you see, can imagine. I thought that I might get you since you oh, had yeah, been. Know. You never know. No, no. All okay. right. So, how many did you have left? Oh, I've been out the game from the first question. We got him. We got him. Well, so, Wes, myself, and Janelle, we all tied. So, Mr. Ryder, you took the loss this on this is, one. This you got to drink up. It goes. I'm gonna get myself an air horn for that. <laughs> it seems as if a stripper made out of mannequin parts, windscreen wipers, and an old TV camera will be performing at a trade show in Australia. Uh, the Sexpo trade event in Melbourne will play host to the Mechanical Maiden, which was built by a British artist named Gills Walker. Mr. Walker tends to build robots that deal with different social issues and says his pole dancing creation isn't meant to be interpreted as a sex object not only is there a stripper robot but there's also a robot in i believe uh dubai that would like to have a baby so yep. she's requested to have a baby and then there's another robot drone situation taking place in the northwest where i think at the top of the year drones will be uh equipped certain drones will be equipped with rubber bullets and will be able to shoot you in the ass so <laughs> my question is 
with all of this crazy robots. Well, first of all, let me not judge it. There's robot There's stuff robot. going on. Mm -hmm. Wes, have you heard about this? And if so, what do you what do you think, man? Uh, the the stripper robot. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I think that's a cool, you know, like bachelor pad piece. You know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> it's just, you know, like a little entertainment for the boys. Have the homies over. Yeah, have the homies over. <laughs> I wonder I if like she has ass. Does she have ass though? Nah. That's the question. You know, yeah. but you know what? I think what you can do, there would probably be like accessories you could order online to just <laughs> right. kind of outfit, outfit her out with your favorite features. Yeah, true. Aftermarket pieces. Yeah, yeah. get some yeah. little robot clothes. And then I don't know too much about the face. You know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. But Well, think about, my question is, if she comes over to do a lap dance, am I going to get injured? This is <laughs> true. Yeah, you're definitely going to get injured. <laughs> you got to stay away. <laughs> they play that juvenile for the 9-9. Nine -nine. <laughs> but, <think>, done. <laughs> but I think what the bigger point is, right, or like the, the slightly scarier point is, is like the fact that science is getting so good and this technology is getting so good mm -hmm. that they're starting to become like real humans. And like, where does that lead us in 10 years or yeah. five years or 15 years, which is something that we're all still gonna be around to see. And I think certain things are gonna be super positive, right? But there's like real negative things seeing the people that are running the country, mm. what might happen? Mm. No? Yeah, no, absolutely. I just think um, it's crazy to think that we have now these like physical objects have feelings, okay? Like one's requesting to have a baby. It's like, what's our purpose as a human? We're losing that human connection in so many ways like mm -hmm. even with technology even though with the date like let's go back to like even dating apps like you're no longer having that face-to-face -face interaction yeah. you're just swiping to meet that person then what are you going to swipe with robots in the future <laughs> like you know yeah. where where are we where are we coming to like where is that fine line where like human use is no longer you know, valid. Yeah, and we're like seeing it happen overseas, right? Like a lot of the Asian countries are like already kind of in this game and like they're using it on a daily basis and like mm -hmm. not having as many human relationships and connections because they've found that like, you know, it makes it easier or whatever, you know. Yeah, um, it's quicker, it's more efficient. Yeah. It's more efficient. Forget the human. I, I mean, and, and the big question is, does it, you know, is it automatically, does it automatically matter? Like maybe, True. maybe you have the robot baby, maybe it's a cyborg. <laughs> Maybe they, maybe they're great. Maybe, maybe. This baby and they're popping, and you're like, this is great on so many levels. She doesn't argue with me. I can program her to, you know. Oh. Yeah, <laughs> she doesn't talk back. <laughs> I I she doesn't get mad like on that, Instagram. Why are we going that? Look at the yeah. perks of the what damn robot. What if it's a free robot? What if it can help solve world hunger well, and yeah. cure cancer? And I think that that's so true, right? But then the question is, like, is our humanity good enough? to use these technologies in that way. And that's, I think, what scares me personally, because I think that we've seen that not all humans want, you know, what's best for all humans. And that's yeah. when it becomes interesting. That's yep. true. Well, I, uh, one of our producers, Ari, actually brought up to me a while ago that, you know, the, now there were two computers, I think it was Ari and oh, Keith were telling yeah. me, there are two computers, I think this happened on Facebook, yep. where they had built these super quantum computers and then they were communicating. They had them communicate with one another and everything was going great and the scientists were keeping track of what was happening. And then all of a sudden they created their own language and the scientists could not understand what they were saying to each other. Crazy. And so they just shut them yeah. down. After like two days, they were like, we have no idea what you're talking about. So we the computers shut taking over the world. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and then what happens when they get smarter than we do and we can't shut them down? Man, exactly. Y'all never watch Iron Man? Yeah, for sure. Yeah. 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 That is right in there. Yeah. Right yeah. Or oh, what is that other? There's another film I was going to look it up that was like recently nominated for an Oscar that it was kind of. Ex Machina? Is it or Ex, Ma yeah, yeah. Machina? Ex Machina? Yeah, yeah. Ex Machina yeah. or something like yeah. that. You see, that's like. That one was a trip for sure. And I think that, you it know, this shows that this. we're going yeah. there, yeah. you know? Right. And I think that it's up to. But that robot was bad. She was, was, she, was she, fine. She, she, she was fine. You know she I mean? was fine. fine. She had all the robot. attributes. <laughs> <laughs> she had a lot yeah. of bad attributes. No, and, and like that's the thing. They're gonna make them fine. They're gonna make them strippers at first, yep. and then they'll end up being politicians. That's how they get you. Yeah, that's right. how they dance their way <laughs> into <laughs> your mind. <laughs> it's a twerk contest into our lives. It's I robot. Yeah, man. we gotta. We're gonna have to see what happens. Solid. They go through the sexuality and then they take over the world. Sounds about right. It's a good plan. It is. It is. I want to be on the robot side when it all comes. <laughs> yeah, we gotta we gotta crew up with them, create a yeah. secret handshake, and know that we're all good. Yeah. <laughs> all right, guys, we're about to play naughty things. Are you ready? Mm. It's been a pretty clean episode, so I'm hoping I get some information out of you guys. <laughs> <laughs> I'm always naughty. All right, so the way we play this game, there's a yellow bowl, trending colors, of course, mm -hmm. um, in front of us. 
Everyone is going to draw. So one at a time, we're going to draw out a card. We will read it. That person will read it. Everybody else will write down the answer to that question. We put it in a bowl, and that person who read the question has to guess who said what. Okay. So here we go. Mr. Ryder, you're starting us off, okay? Can we have someone else fold our papers? Because I don't want you to guess how I folded mine. I'm a very specific folder, and I know you guys will know. <laughs> so well, no. Does that like carry over to like toilet paper too? Every, yep. Yeah. <laughs> Every type of paper, paper towels. Oh, yeah. You <laughs> fold paper towels. I fold everything. Fold. Interesting. Wow. Your clothes yeah. are probably super organized. Yeah. Very, very organized. I'm just really? like my cl- my house is like spotless all the time. Mm. Never have clothes. What you- I saw my I saw <laughs> my bra raised. I never, I never yeah. have clothes yeah. on the floor. Yeah. Very tidy individual. <laughs> his face. <I> will- <laughs> his, fa- his face tells us otherwise. <laughs> all right. So I'll start us off, guys. Right, Joe? Be honest. You know, it's okay to be honest. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. Let me give you a Sharpie. Thank Sharpies you. all around. Okay, so here's the first question. I see how nasty we're getting. Oh, no. I'm scared. Ooh. Producer Tay. What is your favorite way? I'm going to add a little something. What's the most effective way <laughs> for you to be seduced? What's the most effective or your favorite way for you to be seduced? How did I get you in the room? The bedroom. Where you belong. <laughs> Where you belong. What's the favorite way? Don't and Wes, don't be over there to write nothing like church <laughs> hymns. I don't want to hear nothing <laughs> like that out of you today. <laughs> <laughs> I, I haven't perfected my fold like Wes. I'm checking all folds. Yeah. All folds. If it's got a special fold, you know it's Wes. This is what it is. Janelle has a whole instruction book. <laughs> She's writing a novel. She's giving them keys. She's well, guilty. The, thing you need the to girl do that's never, never been to a sex store. We got to go. Now we're going. I'm like tempted to record <laughs> now. Trip. <laughs> trip. There's going to be a piece of content. Yeah, it's after this drinking down. game. <laughs> What's the name of the one? I don't know. Hustler. Oh, see, she knows the name. We right shot off a top piece of, of content head. there. We shot a piece of content there. I'm sure. <laughs> Sorry, my paragraph is almost done. Not for wow. the kids. <laughs> oh. That's creepy. Oh, yeah, that was weird. Should they be truth? I mean, are they supposed to be truthful? Or should of they course, be like, of course. You got to tell the truth. Oh, okay, okay, okay. We're all about the truth. I wasn't on was like one of those, like, um,. Um, Cards Against Humanity responses where it's out of this world. Oh, uh, yeah. No, it's got to be real. It's got to be real. We, we want to yeah, get to know you, you guys. you go that far? No. Huh? <laughs> I may have went that far. I don't know. Uh, <laughs> oh, here we go. All right. I'm, I'm pulling. I'm pulling. He's I'm pulling, pulling out. <laughs> I'm pulling out. All right. This is getting weird. Oh, wow. Okay. So the first answer is music and love. So that mm-hmm. is very, very sweet and beautiful. Beautiful. Okay. That's how you seduce. All right. The second answer that I'm pulling out is a night of dancing and getting to know each other. Mm. <laughs> what is going on here? All right. Okay. I guess music is a factor. Well, music is a factor. Music. Right, yeah. All right. And last but not least, massage. <laughs> oh, massage. That's this a good is, one. That's a good one. Solid. Yeah, it gets everyone. A massage gets it done. Okay, so let me guess who's who here. Whoever said a night of dancing and getting to know each other is definitely one of the ladies. <laughs> is it? I think so. Mm. And uh, the I assumptions mean, are real. No, they, they, they are. They are. <laughs> We're all human. Uh, I'm gonna go with. I'm going with Janelle for a night of dancing and getting to know each other. The dancing okay. I'm getting from Miami because yeah. we like to dance. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. And uh, getting to know each other, I just, I, I just think that's your vibe. Yeah. Because you haven't been to a sex yeah. store, so I feel yeah. like getting to know each other is high up on a priority. Yeah, you got to put, okay. put in at least okay. six months worth of work. Oh, six months. Well, okay. <laughs> Three months. Music and love. I'm going with Haley on this one. Okay. I'm going with music and love. Okay. okay. Just because of the love part. <laughs> I feel and, disrespected. And then, <laughs> yeah. What? And then for the massage, I'm definitely going with my boy West, and it's because. Um, was it I the hear fold? That? Was it the fold? <laughs> it was the fold. <laughs> no, it was the fold. <laughs> it was the fold. No, it was, um, it was because massages are really, really popular over on the east side. And I think that that, that, might, oh, be, that, that might be a move. Sure. I think that Japan might play a part. All right. Hey. Nice. Did he get it right, guys? I, how'd I do? He crushed it. Yeah, that he was pretty it. accurate. That was, that was pretty good. All right. That yeah. means we got a drink and you got to drink water? <sighs> Enjoy water your spikes. This is uh, going towards our field trip to the sex store <laughs> later. Cheers. This water is spiked with H2O, guys. 
<laughs> All right, Janelle, you ready to do this? You mind I, helping me out? I get. I'm. I don't know You're if ready. I'm ready. You're, You're ready. Can't wait. Uh, <laughs> mm-hmm. Number of sex partners, like in life. Mm-hmm. Oh, it just God. says number of sex partners. It could be. Oh man, you have to expose Wait, your. Um, oh my God. In life. Yeah. Okay. In life. <laughs> hey, just How the many numbers of them. sex partners? This is very yeah. revealing. This is. Yeah, this is. This very is intimate. Revealing. We're about to get to know <laughs> each other real quick. Yeah, we got to get to know each other. And don't but lie, there's guys. There's no judging. Yeah, yeah. Don't lie. Don't lie. Yeah, uh, no, question that's been asked: Are we just dumping it? Yeah, just dump it. All right. Put- Whoa, all right. That was a 700. <laughs> 700 <laughs> is what Kevin Ryder just said uh, so quietly. That was Wes. That's, yeah. <laughs> the numbers. Don't lie on it. This is very tempting to lie on. Yeah, you all better not lie. Two, I was I was truthful. We got a lot of people following trending all day. We do. Oh, no. Kyle. I shouldn't have said that. We only got like six people, so don't worry, guys. Don't worry. <laughs> Add those zeros. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Let's we should include black. We should. I was gonna say he's not here. Yeah, we're coming on. Let's include black. Yes. Yeah. 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 Keep it interesting. Keep it interesting. Here's my. Here's a sharpie. Come on. Join the table. I know. Come on. Silent killer. Write it down. Black. Yeah. Do the multiplication. Include the vacation. Yeah. Gotta include those. Gotta include those. He's thinking over here, guys. He's counting. Everyone's counting. Like, did that count? Yeah. It was just the right. Uh, <laughs> There's a lot of just the two. It was just going on oh thinking. gosh. <laughs> uh, <laughs> you like break them apart. You're right. like totals and tip. Total <laughs> tips. You got different sections. Different lists. <laughs> Wes over there doing math. <laughs> do I need a calculator. Do you according need to my calculations? <laughs> did you do yours? Oh, I don't have a writing utensil, so I think I'm out. Oh, oh would you like no, a Sharpie? No. I will do- gladly oh, donate mine. Oh, Here you go. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Way right. to try to get out of it, though. You I were know, quiet. I know, you were quiet. No, I thought Splack like, was filling hey. in. I thought, I no, thought Splack was no, filling in. No, okay. yeah. <laughs> All right, I'm going to have to round down. <laughs> no. You, you round up in math. That's the one thing I learned. <laughs> got, it. got it. Yeah, it's a half. You got to, like, you mm-hmm. know. Mm, I got you. <laughs> I feel like this is gonna be an interesting round because there's three guys and a girl. It becomes a bit different dynamic when you're not playing, Janelle. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. Hey, but you- we finally got Splack to talk. This is amazing. Hey, <laughs> I know, it's one of those things. It's just throw like, it in the bowl, my friend. <laughs> I'm Heaven's a bit nervous. There. Yeah, me too. Because I don't want to like just generalize because you know it's just <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Sharing is caring. Yeah, sharing is caring. All right. How you are people friendship. folding? How are people folding? You got, Let's you see. know, a cross cross. Like well, I'm not paying one, attention. Two. I'll close my eyes. A one, How two. You fold it. Just sure, sure. That's what that's what they all say. Mix it up mm-hmm. too. Mix it up. All right. Oh boy. Let's begin. Shall we? Yeah, here we go. Everybody Were you guys the honest? Is everyone like, what was the level of honesty? Oh, the level of honesty was absolutely 100 percent on point. Zero. Okay. <laughs> Many in lust, only one in love. That was okay. Mm. Yep, that was good. Whoever That's, wrote that, mm-hmm. that was a good move. And I okay. have guesses. All right. <laughs> Next, three dot dot dot. Well, two and a half. Mm. Okay. Mm-hmm. Interesting. All right. Mm. When we talk numbers, let's think about how many kids we have. <laughs> Yeah, all creative motherfuckers up in here. That's a good one. Mm. I think those are gentlemen, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I've been keeping it clean. 20 girls times two college <laughs> plus one grad school equals unknown. <laughs> what? These are all creative. <laughs> My dumbass have been like, this number. Oh, all right. Those are very you creative. You don't have to write nothing? And there's one more, right? That's it, four. There's oh, four because she didn't play. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Why didn't you play? She asked the <laughs> it's question. It's her turn. I don't like that. <laughs> All right. Wes so wants to know. <laughs> all right. I'm going to go with. This is hard. You guys were all on the same page. That was solid. You guys definitely had yeah, some like yeah, under the table were. text. They had, like, there were some texts that went down. Or <laughs> something. That, like mental telepathy. Um, I, I hit all the bros before. Just got like, it. Okay. <laughs> cool. I know the I know the code now. I'm gonna go. 
Kevin with the 20 girls in junior oh. college. Oh. Wow. Why? I don't know. God fear of man. <laughs> I'm going to go it's black with many and less, only one in love. Mm. Interesting. That's deep. Are you that, are you that smooth black? <laughs> <laughs> well, he's like the silent killer over there. I don't know, maybe. Oh, silent okay. killer? Oh. So new, let's see your new Instagram name. <laughs> Uh, when we talk about numbers, I'm going to go with what's good over here. Mm. And then uh, three dot dot dot, well, two and a half. I'm going to go with <laughs> <laughs> It was just a tip, so it doesn't count. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to shave numbers. Yeah. Wow. So how wrong was I? You, I, hey, I was definitely not. Yeah, You were wrong about me. What I was one you? of the others. What were you? One of the other ones. Of the, I knew the men, the men got the creative. <laughs> well, I don't know. Maybe not. No, you're right. You you got me. You got me. Hey, right. yeah, you got okay. me. Okay, so drink. You got, got you were right. You got me right. Really? Yay. So hold on. So split. What was yours? The twenty girls. <laughs> <laughs> Not the silent killer. <laughs> yeah, nice. Yeah, nice. You were accurate. I was right? close. Silent, right. but deadly. Nice. Silent, <laughs> but deadly. You see? Yeah. I mean, it was either one way or the other. other. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Great. Nice work. All okay. Right. Nice. Nice work, Kid Rider. Well, she. Right. Well, you actually missed one, Janelle. So you got a drink. Oh, um, yeah. Wes is drinking water. Yeah. And I think we're... Uh, Would you we're like a drink? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All, right, All right, Wes, you're up. Can I get a drum roll, please? Boom, boom, Maraca? boom. There we go, there we go. I need that energy. Why did oh. you get the law and order? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, oh. You're in this game now. <laughs> Favorite technique when going down on a partner? Oh, wow. Taylor, oh, producer we Tay. Talk. Is, what is going on? I'm trying to get my own tips. <laughs> <laughs> she said she's trying to get her own tips for those of you who couldn't hear. Yeah, that's okay. Favorite, Can you read it one more time? One more time. Favorite technique when going down on a partner? Can we borrow your pen, Wes? Absolutely. Oh, I took it. Oh, no worries. Okay. It's Black Osmo. Yeah, we're good. we're good. I can share. Oh, man. Wait, favorite technique? Favorite technique. It's Black, you in on that, too. So you ain't got to just be, be shy over there. Oh, don't be shy, it's Black. <laughs> don't be shy. Where'd I put the used ones? Right? Damn. Um. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. Favorite technique. Name it. Get creative, you have guys. One? Nah, I don't know. <laughs> get, get creative. That's, that's all I'm expecting out of here. Mm hmm. <laughs> mm. <laughs> it's getting deep in here. Deep. Okay. All right, we got one in. Got one in the bowl. Let me look at my I'm not worksheet. The one guessing. I don't know. I don't know. My I got, worksheet. I got a worksheet. Uh, Janelle, you you got it over there. I don't know. Yeah, you don't I don't know. know. Yeah, who I knows? I mean, you know. Who has it? Needs a pen. Sheet. I think we're good. Where's the insert bolt? Oh. <laughs> the insert. <laughs> <laughs> Relax. Y'all getting punny over there. Y'all getting punny. Let's mix it up. Hold on. Splack's got to put his in. Try to double. Splack we definitely, before in. the end of the show, have to find out how he got that name, too. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's probably the 20 gets plus. It was <laughs> <laughs> one of the 20. Yeah. Splacky, Splack attack. <laughs> Splack attack. Oh, All right. <laughs> okay. Wow. Oh, well, he's right. doing a preview read. I know. Yeah. He's out so here reading them reading all one. of them at one time. He's got the bowl. <laughs> all right. So I got the bowl. Uh, and the question was. <laughs> sorry. Um, favorite technique when going down on a partner. So we have making sure making sure all the bases are covered. Mm. Mm -mm. Got to make sure they're covered. Mm -hmm. Motorboat with a finger jab. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Jab? <laughs> Someone said deep and kiss from the neck down. So I think the women wow. said deep and kiss from the neck down. <laughs> <laughs> One of y'all fools said motorboat with a finger jab and make sure all bases are covered. So Wait, no, wait. You got to guess. Yeah, yeah. yeah I mean, you got to give names. The, guy, okay. the guys, the guys. Okay, okay. so uh, uh, kiss from the next down seems like Janelle. Mm. <laughs> all right. Deep, Haley. <laughs> That's you. Um, okay, so now th this one right here is, uh, you know, I have to think about, like, who would say something as ignorant as motorboat with a finger jab. Uh 
I feel like that's Kev. <laughs> <laughs> like, you would say that. And then that's make crazy. sure all the bases covered. That's Splat keeping it safe. <laughs> and uh, that's 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 my guess. Is how'd I do? Yeah, you got me. Hey, I'm, hey, I'm, hey, I'm gonna be honest. Wrong for me. <laughs> wrong for you. He, oh, oh wow. that's crazy. She crazy. Which one were you, Jenna? She's deep. What are you, she's deep. She's deep. She's not, not deep. You're not deep. deep. You're I'm covering deep. all the bases? You got me right. She's oh, covering so that the means bases. these two. So Splack oh, went Splack went Hold surprising. on, what was your Splack? Uh, kiss all the way down. <laughs> oh, kiss all the way down. I didn't even remember. Yeah, I, I just, I failed. <laughs> <He assumed. laughs> uh, yeah. Wait a second. Y'all so supposed to be good friends. Yours? <laughs> Mine was deep. <laughs> yours was deep? Okay, yeah, good. And then you were what? Making sure all the bases were covered. Mm. Ah, damn it. Yeah. That was good, though. Yeah, you got him. Hey. Yeah, nice. You got to drink, yeah. drink that water. All right, now that Splack has joined the crew, you got to, you're next. So you go, Splack. <laughs> <laughs> Give us a topic. All right. We have more paper, too. Yep. Ready? I like this game. This is very. Oh, did anyone? Very sketchy game. Oh, wait, we're we going white now? Yeah. Oh, shit. Good. Let's see. Oh, my right. gosh. <laughs> yep. Yep. Come on. You're part of the game. Let us know. Um, all right. So this one says, describe your first orgasm or nut. Oh. Oh, a Taylor. <laughs> <laughs> we got to have what a production meeting. <laughs> <laughs> getting really nasty. Yeah, this is nasty. <laughs> wow. Describe um, your first orgasm or nut. <laughs> this is hilarious. God. Okay. How, you remember? <laughs> <laughs> How many the number two pencil? I don't know. I don't even remember that. So oh, you have a pen. Ago. He said it was so go. long ago. There y'all go. Uh, oh, yeah, here. Right. Wait, it's black. That's it. <laughs> you gotta get specific sometimes. You have to shake that <laughs> gotta, Yeah. You gotta give it a good shake. Oh, specifics. <laughs> the details. Yeah, sometimes you gotta. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. All right, <laughs> it'll be interesting. <laughs> Good luck, everyone. Yeah. All right. So the question was, um, <laughs> wow. The question was, describe your first orgasm or nut. This one is magical. Oh. Solid. 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 <laughs> The second one, <laughs> I thought I peed in myself again. <laughs> this one is confusingly wet. <laughs> wow. Wow. <laughs> well, that's one of the girls. That's amazing. <laughs> I can't read that bottom part, but surprisingly fun and covering. <laughs> Is that what that says? I got some bad handwriting. <laughs> I can't read it. Can you read that? <laughs> yeah, you try to pretend. Somebody pretend. Yeah, pretend. Yeah, pretend. Yeah, pretend. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so what is this saying? All right, so I'm gonna go. Okay. Oh, is it con carnivore? No. Oh, carnivore. Weird. Converting. Converging. <laughs> all right. Uh, okay. Since she's never been to like a sex store, uh -huh. <laughs> I'll say confusingly wet for you, Janelle. Okay. All right, okay. Janelle. I feel like you, you're such a lovey, lovey type of girl. You'll be magical. Mm. Okay. All right. He's handing them out. He's placing them out. He's handing them out. This one's for you. This is you. She but she. That, is magical? it could be both. I mean. You never know. You never know. <sighs> Damn. <laughs> mm. I wish we knew what that last word was. Yeah. <laughs> this is yeah it's between me and Wes. I feel like you peed in yourself. <laughs> okay, you know, that's just, he's that's like handing them really out. Fun and I, feel, I don't know what that is. Don't, even know what don't act like you don't know that's your hair writing. <laughs> 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 Come, 
<laughs> you know what it is. All right, so how wrong was I? You got mine right. You got mine right. Oh! You got me wrong. Oh, oh, you got me wrong. Ted, what did it say? It hey. said, I, can I see it? You don't Stop. even you I think know it was what you wrote. Surprising, fun, and concerning was the actual oh, concerning. Oh. I was concerned. Concerned. You peed on yourself? No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you, uh oh. <laughs> that is so funny. <laughs> so that means we drink? That um, means, yeah, 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 I guess that means we drink. Nice work. That was pretty impressive. That was pretty impressive. For the record, it wasn't pee. Yes. It wasn't. Nah. We don't believe it. All right, it's my turn. You guys have paper over there? I'm yep. Sure you guys have paper. That. Make sure paper. everyone uses the white. All right, I'm scared. Here we go. I'm scared of what the next question is. I really am. I am too. This is just. Yeah, I'm pretty. I'm pretty. It's actually crazy. It's pretty concerning. I'm going to pick it up. <laughs> Insert air quotes. Oh. All right, here we go. Negative decision. If my partner did blank while having sex, I'd go straight home and block the number. Wow. Oh. Ooh, this is. If my partner did blank while having sex, <laughs> I'd go straight home and block the number. Put it in the bowl, guys. Put it in the bowl. I don't have a writing utensil. So. Oh, he, oh you got do you need one? There's a pen. We right can there. pass it down. All right. If my partner did blank while having sex, I'd go straight home and block the number. Mm. Mm, okay. I feel like I know what a few of these are going to be. I got guesses. You ready? Yeah, this naughty things game. It's, it's a good one, right? That's it's nasty. good. All right, here we go. <laughs> and nasty. <laughs> and nasty. All right. <clears throat> First time. one. Say someone else's name. That's a good one. Mm. Mm. Say my name, say my name. <laughs> Sharded. Oh. That would be rough. That would be rough. That would, that be, would tough. be rough. That would be tough. Called a guy to join. Mm. That would be rough. That's rough. That's for some. Nasty. Call me someone else's name. Oh, there's a double. Yikes. Double, that's a big okay. no. So I'm going to go call me someone else's name is Janelle. <laughs> Sharded is Wes. <laughs> Wes, you're immature. <laughs> Say someone else's name is Black. And called another guy to join is Kev. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Drum roll. Okay. All right. That's nasty. Uh, you got me wrong. I got you wrong. Yeah. Got me wrong okay. too. I got you wrong too. Wow. Damn. Yeah. You right? Yeah, you got me. You got me. Got you. <laughs> I got you. So you guys were switched. Wait. So you were. Wait. So so you guys were the two of the same or similar. This one was you. That's wrong. Sharded yeah. was you. <laughs> That's Yo, should that be surprising people? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. She's a solid but deadly too. Yeah. yeah. And you're called. Yeah, that would. Yeah. All right. I just, I, mean, I mean, I just went with something that for sure. That was like a no that go. Is, That's yeah. a no go. I mean, it was. That's a no go. You wouldn't care? I. I mean, yeah, you wouldn't care about the shark? You wouldn't care about what? Someone said you, someone. He wouldn't care. Sharded? She said someone else's name. Black really? wouldn't care. You would, you well, wouldn't maybe care. It was just like a one night stand, but if it was your girl, you might care. Oh yeah. Yeah. Hold yeah. on. So, oh, okay. I thought he was saying he didn't care about the shirt, and I was like, I thought that was. <laughs> I was gonna say. I was like, <laughs> I thought, Is there a poop trend that I'm not aware maybe of? Maybe there's a new poop, poop trend. All right, here we go. This is our last one. So. All right, last one. Here we go. We about to hop in. Uh, let's see. Make it a good one. I'll, I'll try. Can I? You could do it. You can do a second pull if it's not. Okay. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> a second pull. <laughs> Uh, no pun intended. What? <laughs> oh, let's see. This, these get real reckless. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> he gave major side eye to Tay. <laughs> okay. This, okay. Is, this is a good one to wrap up with. Okay. okay. Sex or romance? Ooh. Which oh. Which is more important in a relationship and why? Oh. And really? why? Are we sure we wanna? No, you know, the sex or romance. Sex or romance. Wait, wait, let me let's let's just draw in, another in one. In a relationship. In yeah, the, yeah, in a relationship. Like, can we draw another one? Do you want to end? Uh -oh. You want to end it quick? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. My co-host is saying, "Do you should I go?" Can we draw another one? one? Of course. Yeah. I mean, it's the last one. I want to yeah. make it. Let's high. draw. Let's draw another one. Okay. All right, the last one. Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> oh. 
Okay, all right. Can I get approval? Or? <laughs> I'm not supposed to read it. Oh, yeah, you are. Yeah, that's good. You like this one? Sure. Okay. Keep it interesting. What words or sounds or gestures do you make to let your partner know they're doing the damn thing in bed. That is actually the question. The damn thing. Is <laughs> what words, sounds, or gestures do you make to let your partner know they're doing the damn thing in bed? And not only do you have to write it down, but you have to have to make the sound. Oh, stop. No, that's no on, you're added. That's on the back. That's on the, no, that's not on the back. <laughs> you're, you're. <laughs> He's like, I'm never coming back. <laughs> Can you read it one more time? What words, sounds, or gestures do you make or say to let your partner know, look, baby, you doing the damn thing. Damn baby. thing. Oh. Thang, thang. Thang. Careful for Wes's fold. You know, there's going to be like an origami <laughs> in there or something. <laughs> what is that just a yeah, line? Is that a, what is that? That's dumb. Why didn't you gotta fold it? I thought I didn't There's look. different, different ones. You better come up with a different answer. <laughs> cheating over here. All right, there's four of them. Okay, so. <clears throat> All right, I'm going in. Um, let's see. All right, so there's. See, I should have thought about the sounds because this just says. <laughs> <laughs> this just says. <laughs> this says, Kamehameha. <laughs> With a lot of exclamation points. Can you please say it how someone would say it? Kameha, beha, kameha, beha. Is that Dragon Ball Z? <laughs> okay, so be. somebody did a drag. Kameha, beha is the Dragon Ball Z answer. I, yeah, I got guesses. Looking around, at you. An arm or hair grab for sure. <laughs> An arm or hair grab for sure. Okay. <laughs> arm and hair grab are two very different things. <laughs> yeah, that's meant to put arm bar. <laughs> <laughs> um, word is oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> the gesture is vibrate. <laughs> so this person says that the word is oh shit, and their gesture is vibrate. Wow. And last but not least. Yes, and a good grip. <laughs> <laughs> yes, and a good grip. This is going to be fun. All right. Kamehameha. <laughs> An arm or hair grab for sure. Oh, shit with a vibrate. And yes, with a good grip. All right, so if I had to guess, let me look around the room. And this is, okay, I got this. Um, For Haley... You get an arm or a hair grab for sure. <laughs> um, for yes, with a good grip. I'm going with Miss Janelle. I'm just gonna set this right here. This right. He's this handing them out. Yeah, he's <laughs> I picked that up from some sort of <laughs> um, One of the brothers over here said Kamehameha. So I'm going with. <laughs> so I'm going with Wes. Wes did it because you wouldn't tell on yourself like that. And then, oh shit, with a vibrate. <laughs> oh shit with a vibrate I'm giving this black that's the one that's the one how did I how did I do <laughs> did, did, did. What? <laughs> which one was yours which one was yours oh uh, yeah he got me hey. Hey. all yeah. right nailed it Kamehameha wrong for me mine was wrong oh my, mine was right for, oh. those, for those of you who don't know, big, big Dragon Ball Z fan. So yeah, that, 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 that I was heard it, I was like, I know. Phenomenal. And it right. sounds like you got us mixed up, but that's okay. Yeah. Mm. Mixed up. Okay, so you're the arm hair, arm or hair. I should have known. I should have known. It just depends on the position. You know, yeah. the arm or, the, I don't know. Hold on, what hair are you grabbing again? <laughs> you know, if, there, hair. if there's hair. If, oh, God. Even it. if there's not, like, you can still push your Yeah, exactly. Okay. Just whatever you can grab. <laughs> Okay, great. <laughs> I like it. All right, so Janelle's grabbing arms. Fellas, if you want to know, <laughs> Janelle's grabbing arms or hair, so just be prepared for that. <laughs> Haley's yelling out, yes, and is, I mean, what else hey. is he doing? 
Yeah, and then uh, yeah, uh, a grab too. The grabbing the is a grab. girl thing. She's so. grabbing. There's two, uh, two females, two grabs. Be prepared to meet Goku when you're with West. <laughs> <laughs> and and the vibrations. The vibrations are happening. <laughs> Ladies, the vibrations would be right. That is hilarious. <laughs> well, you're nice. dealing with splag. All right. All okay. Right. That was fun. Well, now that we've done Ooh. a lot of uh, very <laughs> nasty things, <laughs> talked about a lot of nasty. Um, we about to hop into That's this. Nasty. <laughs> we about That's to hop nasty. into this next record. Um, you forgot to drink. Yeah. Oh. oh yeah. yeah. I guess. Yeah, I you had to drink. Uh, cheers, drink. cheers, 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 guys. So, <clears throat> two weeks ago, I'm talking from, to a buddy in college. He's now living in South Florida, and he says to me, "Kev, every girl that I meet that's beautiful <laughs> has a hundred thousand followers, mm. and so I feel I'm in, I'm in competition. Feels like he's in competition." With the world. And he was like, you remember when you meet a girl, she was beautiful, and there was a lot of, like, value and, like, my attention. <laughs> now my attention and value has gone down significantly. So I want to ask you all, as people who get 100 million direct messages a day, uh -huh. you know, um, what is that? Like, you know, have you experienced that? What do you think of that? Because I'll say that from the outside looking in, it that does seem like a challenge. I can see that being a challenge. Do you have any experience should, with that? Should I start? Yes, yeah, yeah. yeah, you should start. Uh, yeah. Um, I feel that a lot of people can be intimidated by what we do, mm. and if they're wrong, at the end of the day, we are people. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Like they're like, oh yeah, like you said, like they assume like, oh, you get a million direct messages, or I get DMs are like, oh, I'm sure you've heard that, like, oh, you've been told like, oh, you're beautiful all the time. I'm yeah, sure you get that all the time, and it's like. <laughs> <laughs> right? You agree. Yes, especially. Especially, you're like, yeah. It, you know, you're beautiful all the time, but that's not like necessarily the case. And that doesn't mean that I don't appreciate comments, like or compliments, you know, mm -hmm. like I appreciate, I'm like, oh, like I still blush, like, like, you know, I still giggle or whatever. I appreciate uh, like an honest, sincere compliment. Now, if you're like signed to DMs and you're all nasty, then it's like, eh, I'm okay. Right. Yeah. You know? Um, yeah. I can see, especially if you've never been to a sex store, that is quite <laughs> alarming to see what you your DMs. <laughs> What about you guys? Black, I'll let you, I'll let you go first, Black. Uh, I mean, I, it's not that bad, but I know for me, like from my experience, um, <laughs> thank you, Wes. <laughs> yeah, no problems, Black. Let them know how you feel. Uh, for me, from a guy perspective, I know I get a lot of questions from girls. It's like when I try to, you know, talk to someone, they always say, like, why me? Because you're like, you have all these, like, pretty girls in your videos why you want to talk to me and that's like my number one question i absolutely hate <laughs> what do you say what's your response i just don't talk to them uh, that's, <laughs> a good, that's a good one no response. that's a good one i just stop because they, they they won't be able to handle anything that i do and what about like mm. obviously you understand the influencer perspective but like what if what is it like to meet an influencer girl that might be outside of the network right like you don't know right i love those you like them They're yeah the i prefer uh, all the time though I, I'll, I'll take them anytime interesting okay mm. Okay. What about you, Wes? I mean, um, I'm a firm believer in shooting your shot. Okay. You know, like I mean, the last, question the question last is photo comment. Yeah, the fr yeah, you got to shoot your shot. Like like you said, we're all people. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? And I feel like, you know, just go up and figure out a creative way to say something to them that makes you stand out from somebody else. Yeah. You know. I feel like it's also a different perspective, right? Like if you have a ton of followers and mm -hmm. you're trying to date someone that has another ton of followers, that like is different because you can connect on that level because you're like you know what it's like vice versa too um and also too like being friends with all you guys like you guys are totally chill normal people that like want normal relationships and normal like communication and things like that so i think sometimes it does get like misconstrued mm -hmm. and the dms be a crazy place to go sometimes <laughs> yeah, like sometimes you just got to stay away because it just gets it, gets, it gets wild it gets wild and something that you like don't want to experience i oh go ahead I was going to ask, have you ever met somebody who's been like, oh, shit, you got a lot of followers. Let me go ahead and start uh, talking to you. <laughs> Has that ever happened? <laughs> I'm All sure the for the gentlemen, maybe. I get that more from the guys. Interesting. Interesting. The guys are more so like uh, the more thirstier than the girls. Mm. And the girls, they won't be that like obvious. Yeah. But the guys like. They'll know that you have a following, and I could be talking to a girl. I mean, I, me and Wes probably shared this conversation before, <laughs> and please tell your story. But it was like sometimes you could just talking to a girl, and a dude will come right here, right next to you, all in your space, in your and you're like, 
you see him from your peripherals that like he's just standing right there. <laughs> like shadow You're like, covering? okay, maybe he's over here. Um, he's looking for something. Maybe he's trying to get a drink. Let me just let me keep uh, talking. Listen, he waiting for that moment to be like, <laughs> <laughs> to be like, this is, he waiting for that moment. It's like, how about like, and so I had this idea. Yeah. <laughs> they come with this, like, yo, pitching. so I got this idea. Show their phone. And the girl's right here. And I'm like, yo, dude, what are you doing? <laughs> trying to That's close. That's great. They're trying to pitch. The time. They're trying to pitch. That's so funny. Well, so, and I won't put anybody on blast, but, like, what is it like to also date other influencer girls? Like, is it, like, similar? Like, you guys, like, find, like, there's a lot of similarities and, like, you're able to, like, connect on that level? Or are you like, damn, like, my girl's always being hollered at. Like, how do you deal with that? Well, for me, I haven't really dated anyone else in like in the influencer world, but someone else in the industry. Um, it's, I get it. I get what you're saying. We're like, but I think we kind of, you know that it comes with the job. Right. So it kind of like, you don't care. Cause like, okay, if they're with you, like they're coming home with you, like, okay, it's a hundred percent. Right. Mm -hmm. that, that, that shouldn't really matter. You just have to be, but maybe that's also like, it, it depends on the person. You have to have that confidence as well. Like, you know, like, okay, that's my person. And it doesn't matter like who comes their way, mm. but I, it's like, it's a hit or miss for me of like dating someone within the same field or, or not. Mm. There's perks because yes, they understand what you do and you know, they, they know what it is. You're like, okay, I'm going to go shoot. I'm going to do this. I'm on set. I'm leaving and I'm coming home to you. But then it's also refreshing when you have someone that's like not in the whole world right. and you just get like, you know, a different point of view of life. Mm. Um, I think it's a balance. You know what I mean? Like she said, you know, what comes with the job. But, you know, you, like, it's not a, you know, it's not a jealousy game, you know what I mean? It's just kind of like, you know, you find the balance, you know? I think, um, you gotta remind me what the question was again, because I can go, <laughs> I can go, I can go. Just like, if you were dating, dating someone who has a lot of followers, like, uh -huh. does that affect the relationship? Or like, where do you, where does that conversation lead? Like, do you get jealous by those comments? Or are you just like, we don't deal with like, what happens on social media, this is our real life. Yeah, I mean, someone that has a lot of followers doesn't really define who you are, right. you know what I'm saying? So it's just like, I look at the situations like, we're just normal people, you know, that happen to have followers. The followers, that's, no, that's that's the cool part you know you're collecting mm -hmm. you know you're getting like recognition and fans but that's not what shapes the relationship right. at all you know i don't even think that's i i don't think i know anybody that's in that situation that's like oh man it's all about your followers and not us right. you know yeah. so yeah. yeah that doesn't sound fun have you dated anybody just to like flip it have you dated anybody that doesn't have any followers that's super intimidated by your followers uh, <laughs> said, Janelle's like, yep. yes. <laughs> yeah, tell your story. <laughs> it's funny because like, like the individual won't come out directly about right. it. Mm. You know what I mean? They they try to like spin different topics that like ultimately the root is that. Mm. It's like, oh no, because you this. But Gosh. deep down inside, I think like they want followers too. They you want know what fans. I mean? Yeah. yeah. But at, it's like, it's like such the silliest thing because like sometimes it's like you respect like the other person's like job so much and like it, it comes with their own following even though it's not like social, sorry, Morocco. <laughs> uh, you know, even though it has, has nothing to do with social media, but it's, it's interesting, mm -hmm. you know, yeah. how like that can come into play. Yeah. Um, like how that even comes up as an argument. Like it shouldn't even. Is yeah. that something that and you like, like? I have like baby following compared to these two. <laughs> <you know? laughs> and so it's still cracking. Yeah. yeah. Is that something that you judge too? Like when you're dating someone, are you like, oh, are you like into me for my followers? Like, is that, does that ever come up? I think that's always, I, I think that's always a question that would come up. Like, you know, what are your intentions here? So sometimes I know like just a lot of my friends, we don't even bring that up. Right. You know what I mean? Like, if you know, you know. If you don't know, cool. Let me really get to know you. And then, you know, you got the surprise later. Like, bam. You know? <laughs> <laughs> we got some numbers. I was like, bam. <laughs> <laughs> you know? But, like, you know, that's just kind of like, you know, I, I hate to think we're uh, identified by the numbers that we have. Right. You know, I just, for me, I just really am. It's really about the quality of work you're putting out and if the work's making you happy and you know, if the person sees the work you're putting out and if they're like, oh, you know, I, I respect that or I don't respect that, you know? So, yeah. I like that. That's I like, I like that yeah. much. You're a real dude for that one. That sounds about right. Guys, thank you so much for coming to Trending All Days Radio Show, the first influential only radio yeah. show in the world. We are so happy to have you guys. Before we go, Wes has asked, because he's such a gentleman, that Janelle go first. 
What is yeah. what is going on in your life? What's next? What can your fans and the people look forward to from you? Um, for me, 2018 brings, I'm going to be filming an independent film. So I'm excited about that. So we'll keep our eyes out for that. And I'll be on tour with Monster Jam. Hey. Um, I'll be at six different cities. I'll be in Toronto in January, San Antonio, Houston, Detroit, Arlington, Oklahoma, Anaheim for two dates. So if you guys are not working, you guys should come through. Yes. I'll look it up. Um, and then finally, yeah, at El Paso, Texas. So that's kind of exciting for me. It's kind of like the weekend getaway. So that's up for 2018 so far, the first couple of months. Nice. Amazing. Going on Amazing. tour. I yeah. like it. I like that. Like my, it's like a weekend tour. It's like the best thing. I leave on a uh, Thursday late at night, mm -hmm. work Friday, Saturday, and I'm home by Sunday. So nice. I'm excited it's for not that. so bad. All not right. so bad. And tell the people where to follow you. Oh, follow me at the Janelle Marie, T H E Janelle Marie. Okay, across the board. That's Instagram, across Twitter. Across the board, yeah. Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, Snapchat. Amazing. Mm. Wes, what you got coming up, my brother? All right. Um. Okay. Uh, a lot. A lot. I guess. <laughs> uh. So first thing is uh, wrapping up couples night. Um. You know, closing out this first four chapters of season two, and then ramping up to do another eight of them. And then uh, shooting next week with Daystorm for his new series, uh, Bad Escorts, I'm directing. And another place where I get to, you know, flex my creative muscle. Mm -hmm. And then 2018, like, I like I like going into the the new year not knowing what's up, mm -hmm. you know. And, uh, you know, just feeling my way out just to look, be able to look back at the end of the year like, damn, man, I did all this. Uh, so I'm going into 2018 with Blindfold on, um, but, you know open to all opportunities that are going to take me to the next level. I love that. I love that. And, and, and I think can, can Tad stop by the set when you're yeah, directing to see what you and Daystorm got popping? I got I to I check with the executive producer. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> hopefully, you know, hopefully it'll be, it'll be good because, you know, we're, we're all aiming everyone that's in the cast, everyone that's, uh, that's on the production team. We're aiming to make this like, you know, one of the best projects we've ever put together before. Amazing. All right. And tell everybody where to follow you. Uh, Google me at hey. what's good. I'm on everything. Nice. Love that. Big Splat. What up, man? See, this whole time I'm trying to think of a lie <laughs> to make myself sound like I'm really busy. Because that's like, whole, how, how you know how Hollywood work like yeah, that. He's faking <laughs> it, though. He drinks uh, every day. Yeah. yeah. Uh, but, no, just to be honest, like, still just being creative, trying to, like, always, like, level myself mm -hmm. up and being that I have friends, like, you know, what's good and, like, all these other, like, influencers that kind of, like, pushes me all the time <clears throat> is really motivating. And uh, I know one thing that I'm excited about is like actually doing my first series. I've never really actually took upon like trying to create a whole series my, by myself. And it will be actually for Zeus uh, Daystorm new yeah. app that's coming out. Mm -hmm. um, and my series will be called Liquid J. It's one of this, uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, if you haven't seen it, it's a pretty cool character that I come up with. Uh, it was actually inspired by the, the show The Get Down, which I really wow. love. Right. Uh, so I kind of created this like disco uh, superhero kind of guy. And so I uh, did it on Instagram. People loved it. So they wanted the series. And so I'm doing that. And also, I think I might be dropping a new merch coming up pretty soon. So Merch alert. Uh, yeah. Nice. All about. This, is, this is amazing because, first of all, Splack never talks about what he's doing. Splack just I like, really don't. Bam. I'm a really, <laughs> you go. I'm a type bam, of guy who don't. I'm like, damn, you did this commercial? Yo, Splack, you on this commercial? Like, yeah. Like I, radio I, got him to talk. Hey. Yeah. I, I, don't, I don't talk too much. Mm -hmm. I just like my work just to, like, kind of show and like, well, my friend was like, "I just saw you in an Apple commercial." I'm like, "Why you didn't tell me?" I'm like, "I just don't talk. I don't. <laughs> I don't say nothing. I just like to have people surprised, kind of." Yeah. Um. And so, yeah. Great. Let the work nice, talk. Nice. Nice. Yeah. Well, let us uh -huh. holler at us. Let us know how we can promote it. Oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Definitely. For sure. And you guys gonna come back and visit us here at Tad Radio, do the trending all day thing. Hey, yeah, come on. Yeah. <laughs> Love that. All right. Well, look, we're going to get into this next record before we go. What's Good hooked us up with Redbone. Before we go, let us know what this record is to you, my friend. Uh, Redbone, Childish Gambino. Um, I've always been a fan of Childish Gambino because he's kind of like a black nerd. It's very similar to me. Never met him, but I feel like if we, we met, it, it'd be like vibes. But um, Ch it, what I like about Childish Gambino is he's at a point in his career where he is content with his artistry, you know, and that is a point where I'm working to get to. Like, he doesn't, he doesn't care what you think about what he's doing artistically, musically, acting. He doesn't care. He's going to make a choice. He's going to stick with it. And he's fine with it because he's like, yo, I think this is dope. I don't give a fuck what you think. Mm -hmm. So, like, that is where I'm working to be as a creator. And, uh, you know, I just really admire him for that. And I feel like I'm 
you know, the fact that I recognize it and this song came out, this album came out, I'm like, yo, this is my joint. This is like where, you know, like my life's changing at this point. And now that I'm here, you know, like, let me get to that point where I don't care what you think, but like, you know, while I'm creating stuff, I'm just going to, you know, do the best I can in this moment. And then I'll be able to look back at it later and be like, all right, I learned. I like oh, it. That's fire. Uh, he 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 said these songs didn't mean much, but you know, he had <laughs> a lot of explanations. They mean a lot. All right. Well, thank you guys for making yeah. it to Tad Radio. It's been a wonderful episode. We love you guys. Come back soon. Tad Radio, the first influencer only radio show in the world. Haley, thank you so much for kicking in with us today and just killing it as a co-host. Splat, thank you for making it. What's oh, good? Welcome. Thank you for making it. Yeah. Janelle Marie, make sure you follow everybody. It's Tad Radio at Dash Radio. I'm Kevin, Kevin Ryder. Ryder. It's lit. It's lit. We ready. Oh, this record's coming in. It's nice coming. Slow, it's coming. Too. Hey. <laughs> All right, much love. We'll be back. Talk to you guys in just Peace. a couple weeks. Peace out.